Hey y'all, I'm Sasyada, I'm a Pokemon ROM hacker, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make Trick Room into a weather ability so that you can have auto Trick Room in your own ROM hacks. Let's get started. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go into your HG Engine folder. I'm assuming you already have HG Engine installed, and if you don't, you want to look at one of my previous videos where I show how to install it and get started. We're going to open up our HG Engine folder, and instead of going into RMIPS like we've been doing, we're going to go down to SRC, which is the source code, we're going to double click on that, we're going to go into battle, and then we're going to go into the ability. You'll get this very, very long file of all sorts of different abilities that can trigger in battle, and we're going to want to use Control F to go and find Trick Room. So Trick Room. It should bring you to this bit of the code right here. Now, you'll see that there are two cases next to each other, High Sun and Trick Room. Now, normally these aren't weathers, but we can make them weathers by doing the following. We can type case and then 14 colon under High Sun, and we can also type case 15 colon under Trick Room. And then we're going to hit Control S and save it. Go back to your HG engine and make sure you have the ROM you want to implement this on named ROM dot nds and put that in your hg engine folder you're going to want to open your terminal then with windows key and r and hit ok on opening up wsl and then navigate to the directory where you have hg engine installed so for me it's going to be documents to hg engine hg engine and then we're going to want to run make dash dash jobs and that will compile the rom with the current configurations so now once we have this all done I'll go ahead and skip to what we need to do next. The other application you'll need is DSPRE, and if you haven't gotten DSPRE, you can look in my previous videos on how to download and install it. So DSPRE is an application that allows you to open up a ROM and edit all sorts of things. So in this case, we're going to be opening up the ROM that we're interested in. It'll output the test. You're going to want to edit this test ROM. So now what we're going to want to do is go look at an area that we want to have Trick Room in. So for me, I want Trick Room to automatically activate in Volo's Rift, and that is a place that I have in my ROM head. You'll notice that there is this weather option in DSPRE for each header. So this header here, if we click on open events, it will show you exactly where we are. So this is the entry cave of Volo's Rift, and you can see there's Morty in here, and there's Giratina, and there's all sorts of awesome stuff. And in this cave, you get knocked down to a lower level, and then I want Trick Room to be automatic on those layers. So, what we can do is go into our lower layers, which is right here, this is header 250, open up events, and we can take a look at this area that we fall down into. And I want this trainer to have automatic Trick Room since they have a bunch of slow Pokemon. So the way we do that is we go into our header editor and change our weather to 15. You'll see I already have that done. If I wanted it to be high sun, so automatic drought, I could make that 14 instead. And so you'll see there's all these regular uh, different weathers. And instead of picking one of these, we can pick 14, or which is sun, or 15, which is trick room. You want to hit save this header, and then you'll want to also save and export your ROM as whatever uh, you want it to be called, or you can continue editing. And let me show you how this works in the game. Alright, so here we are in Volo's Rift, and I'm going to go fight Morty, and we're going to see that Trick Room automatically activates, and this also works for uh, wild battles as well. So here we start the battle with Morty. There it is! There's your Trick Room. It will last for, for the first five turns of the battle, so it won't be for the entire battle, but it will function just as Trick Room normally does. If this video helped you, I'd ask that you subscribe since I'm going to be making more tutorials just like this in the future for other HG Engine features that you may not know about. This has been Sasiata. see you in the next video.